Sorry about that. <laughs> I hold your city captive and Ryan's girlfriend hostage. With my gangs of students and evil bosses, nobody can stop me now. Meet my demands. Or else. What demands? P.S. Ox and Ryan, if you interfere, you'll be in for the fight of your lives. Love, Slick. Hey everyone, this is Super Genius 55. This is my Let's Play of River City Ransom for the NES. Gear released around the same time as Double Dragon 2. Uh, it's very similar, you'll notice, if you play Double Dragon. I'm redoing this video as well as the entire series, because I didn't like my first one, I missed out some stuff, so. Anyways, so, this is the jocks, they are beginner level. The jocks, they are... So, this, these are the jocks, they are beginning level game. So, um, I actually think I should explain your stats first. Punch is how well you can punch. Kick is how well you can kick. Weapon is how well you do with weapons. Throwing is how well you can do with throwing people or objects. Agility, how high you jump and how fast you run. Defense is how well you can block attacks. Strength is how well is how long you can hold people. And willpower, how your ability to get up. And stamina is how your health and max power is max power. Okay. Anyways. You need to increase stats by eating food. So it's like an RPG sort of. Let's go there and kick. Take that. Yep, and you, you didn't see, but he took that money. See? He turned it into a coin. And now you must get that coin. That equals money. You can pick up weapons. Um, I've enjoyed Peter Yang and his let's play. I mean, walk through this game. I know that it'd be a let's play or walk through, but uh, yeah, he... You can set up here, and also if you're running, um, you can move up and down, because then they can't get you. Well, he, they can, but it's they're a lot less likely. Oh, crap. Crap. No. Oh. Right. So try to get some money. There's a certain ability you'll want. How much money do we have? Okay, I'll need at least like 26. How much money do we have? Up, I need a little bit more. You can sit up here and you can beat up people that way. It's easier. It's a good strategy to use. Up, oh, two guys in one. What do you think? They may back up from you, so that can be a bit annoying. Take this, and that, and that, and some of these. Alright, I should... He should be in here, but he isn't. That's okay, we have enough to go to the bookstore to get some stuff. Actually, you know what? First, I'll explain how some of this shops work. Okay, the Rise and Shine Cafe. The coffee will give you uh, willpower, strength, stamina, I mean, and max power. The next one will give you. Teal will give you willpower. Hakoko will give you defense and max power. Pancakes will give you stamina and max power, and waffles will give you agility, strength, stamina, and max power. So, I'm not gonna. Man, eh, I'll take some tea. I have enough for that. A little more willpower can hurt. You need to increase your stamina and some, but there is something you might want: the Metro Bakery. So the donut will give you willpower, the muffin will give you agility, stamina, and max power. Bagel will give you defense, stamina, and max power. Sorry, I'm reading something. Uh, so the honey bun will give you strength, will give you strength, stamina, and max power, and the croissant will give you stamina and max power. 
Everything here is taken to go. I still have enough for a little something here. Oh wait, first we'll look at the sushi bar. Oh boy, the sushi bar. There's quite a bit of stuff here. Huh. Cheaper sushi. The egg will give you... Is that sushi? Whatever. The egg will give you um, punch, stamina, and max power. Uh, the next one will give you weapon. The octopus will give you weapon, stamina, and max power. Uh, squid will give you throw, stamina, and max power. The conger eel will give you defense, stamina, and max power. And the prawn will give you... Am I pronouncing that right? Will give you strength, stamina, and max power. For the expensive sushi. Um, next one will give you punch, weapon, stamina, and max power. That's the salmon. The arc shell will give you weapon, willpower, stamina, and max power. Sea urchin will give you throw, willpower, stamina, and max power. The halibut will give you defense, willpower, stamina, and max power. And this last one, Swordfish, will give you Punch, Throw, Strength, Willpower, Stamina, and Max Power. Sorry, I have to read some... I have to read some stuff I can't memorize. I'm not gonna memorize all this. Ugh. Salad Roll. Stamina and Max Power. Each of them is gives you Stamina and Max Power. Ugh. Now we move on to the bookstore. Here's what you want. Alright, and... Whoa, oh, I need, I just need a few more cents. Anyways. Alright. Stone hands will let you punch three times in the normal amount of time it takes to punch once. Dragon feet, same thing, but for kicking, I'm gonna get that. What? Oh no, I don't have enough money. Uh, need to get a little more. Die. There, I have just enough. And the dragon feet will cost you. And so you know, Acro Circus will uh, let you jump in a sort of a. Sort of like a spinning ball kind of pattern, and you can hit enemies that way. Well, I'm gonna end things now. This was the stupid GS55 saying goodbye.